As we move on to the fifth rite of brotherhood, it's important to understand that our communities need to grow in emotional intelligence. They need to understand how a body language, eye contact, physical touch, all of these things communicate immense or strong, passionate messages to the people that we interact with. Um, and this is found deep inside the life of the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi wa Wasallam. And Imam Sha'rani Rahimahullah Ta'ala pretty much highlights upon this knowledge and understanding about how our body language can communicate to people messages that are profound and deep and have a deep impact on the people that we interact and engage with. I'm going to begin this right before talking about the right directly uh, about a hadith in which the Rasul Sallallahu is narrated he was once sitting inside the masjid and the masjid was empty he was there alone and the masjid is no one's there whole masjid is empty and a man walks into the to the masjid so the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam he notices that this man walks in so when he notices that he slightly scoots over and that scooting over to zahzahala, who is the word used in Arabic, he, he, he moved, he made some body movement, scooting over, or adjusted himself in some way. So subhanAllah, the man who walked in noticed that the Prophet Sallallahu moved and he said, Ya Rasulullah, fi makan, there's tons of space in this masjid. There's no need to move for little bitty me walking into the masjid. And the Prophet Sallallahu touches on, upon something which is a key aspect of emotional intelligence is he says, no, it is the right of a Muslim that when he sees another Muslim, the least that he or she should do is move around or make some body movement out of recognition for that other person. Now, all of us have been in those situations where you walk in late to class, you walk into a lecture, you walk into some gathering, and someone makes eye contact with you, slightly moves, smiles at you, and gives you this feeling that you're welcome too. The Prophet ﷺ is teaching us, and Imam Sha'arani, he says that the fifth rite of brotherhood is that when your brother or sister comes to meet you, you uh, uh, you move for them, you stand up, you greet them, you, you know, shake their hand, give them dap, whatever you want to call it, but you make some movement to them and you recognize their presence and let them know that they are important as well.